Whitehaven is set to get even more shook up thanks to even newer redevelopment plans by Graceland. WMC Action News 5's Jason Miles is live for us along Elvis Presley Boulevard with this story all new at 10. Jason. Well, it may be difficult to see at night, but uh, the new hotel here at Graceland, the progress being made on it is pretty amazing if you've been down here. Now, new construction permits reveal what may be in store for across the street. The guest house at Graceland has gone up nearly as quickly as an Elvis record on the charts, but soon the existing hotel, named for one of his biggest hits, will come down. That's according to new construction permits filed by Elvis Presley Enterprises. Have you been to Graceland before? Three times. And what, why do you like coming here? Because it's Elvis. Ray Kenworthy told me he'd make the trip from Manchester, England, no matter what's around Graceland. You know, anybody who likes Elvis will come whatever it's like. But soon things may be even more fit for a king. According to the permits and published reports, all of these buildings across Elvis Presley Boulevard from the mansion will be demolished and replaced. A new museum, restaurants, and retail space are part of an overall 30 plus million dollar plan. Elvis's two planes, once the subject of controversy, will reportedly remain grounded right here once the new development is complete. I think it sounds great. The Miller family from Illinois was visiting Graceland for the very first time. You actually need the facilities to be able to ha handle all the people that are coming here. And perhaps the city of Memphis can take care of business elsewhere in Whitehaven as well. And the city of Memphis has actually done quite a bit of uh, streetscape work in uh, recent years, uh, improvements to intersections and uh, lighting. Uh, Graceland officials tell me that uh, later this summer they will reveal more about their big plans for across the street. Reporting live from Whitehaven, Jason Miles, WMC Action News 5.